Hello, Calgary Catholic. Brian Zumlis here, your chief, chief superintendent. Today, I'm joined for my vlog with Elder Wanda First Rider. Wanda is from the Blackfeet Nation. And Wanda, thank you so much for being with me today. I know this has been a very terrible, tragic week as the discovery of the 215 children. And on behalf of everyone here in Calgary Catholic, I want to present you and the entire Indigenous community with this offering of flowers and orange. And Wanda, we would love to hear from you. You know, what are your thoughts about the events that we're all dealing with, as well as what are your thoughts related to the possible name change of Bishop Grandin High School? So over to you. Okay. The new Ada, Ambawa Stitch, Danse, Ujur, Kitukanetsumatibua. Greetings to all. I would like to start off by paying respect to the remains of the 215 children buried at the Kamloops Residential School. Amatutsiman, smudge, is sent to their families and to all members of their nation. This devastating news has reopened our shared memories and the horrific experiences we share as survivors of the Indian residential schools in Canada. The loss of these valuable children's lives have expanded the conscious awareness of our horrific truths, which includes the name change of Bishop Brandon High School. We want you to know that in spite of the current news that we are faced with, our department, Indigenous Education, has been consulted by our, our district. We want to assure you that we continue to work in consultation with our Indigenous community to promote authentic change, to arrive at a shared perspective, to continue to influence change in the historical loss of our Indigenous ways of knowing, including the name change of Bishop Brandon High School. We will keep you updated as we move forward with our current challenge. Well, thank you, Wanda. And I know as our trustees contemplate the possible name change of Bishop Grandin, we want to hear from our community. We want to hear from our parents. We want to hear from the students of Bishop Grandin. We want to hear from our staff. And to hear those voices, you know, takes a bit of time. Uh, we understand the timeliness of making a decision, and I'm confident that our Board of Trustees will make the decision soon. And so with that, uh, I want to thank you and, uh, and you and your team and for your guidance and to being strong through this and to be there for everyone who's part of Calgary Catholic. So blessings on your day. Peace.